हरे कृष्णा जस्ट बिकॉज वी हैव अ राइट टू बी एंग्री डजेंट मीन वी आर राइट टू बी एंग्री ऑफन पीपल हर्ट अस बिट्रे अस पीपल कैन एक्ट इन आउटरीजियस वेज एंड वी मे फील एंटायरली जस्टिफाइड टू बी एंग्री विथ अस एंग्री विथ देम and certainly uh, we have we there can be situations where we have a right to be angry but relationships are not about claiming our rights rather uh, relationships are about choosing what is right and claiming our rights is not always right in some situations anger may alienate the person and worse aggravate the situation and at such times we may want to curb our emotions not to suppress them not to repress them but to process them properly ourselves and then to maybe present them at a time when the other person is also in a calmer frame of mind because generally the heat of emotion uh, melts and dissolves our intelligence and the same applies to the other person also when we are outraged we can't always think clearly and we may not be able to express ourselves properly even when our anger is justified and the other person might be too defensive or counter aggressive to also be thinking clearly that's why it is important for us to work in a, to not necessarily focus on the right to be angry focus we can focus on what is the right way forward the bhagavad gita cautions us that anger is one of the gates to hell trividham narkasyedam dwaram nashanam atmanah kamah krodhas tatha lobhas tasmade tatrayam tejet so krishna says its lust anger and greed are the gates to hell and we avoid them as much as possible so what this means is that we need to work for protecting ourselves by keeping ourselves in a situation where we don't just vent out just because we are justified to vent out uh, instead we calm ourselves and then deal with the situation more maturely in a proper way so uh, focusing on what is right means that there are times when we need to express our anger also we need to be assertive we don't have to be passive and let other people do whatever they want with us but we don't have to be aggressive also in simply hitting back at people because of what they have done to us so to have this balance it is best to to check our emotion not just uh, act on our emotion and one way to do this is to consider our purpose now if we have a bigger purpose in life if we have something important to do then we won't waste our energy and emotion getting angry we'll focus on that purpose and and we keep pursuing that purpose without giving into that anger then later on as we have calmed down we can calmly explain our our side of the story and based on how they respond we can move forward in that relationship thank you hare krishna